All right. <clears throat> I think we're uh, we're good. I tested the uh, audio earlier, so I think the audio should be good. We'll see if I can get a little feedback from uh, someone that's watching. See if it's choppy or if we are. Started. Should be. Let's see. Got everything. Uh, this is the five box mixer for uh, optic retail. We got hobby mega. Two blasters, so choppy audio, son of a mother. Okay, so crappy. Uh, it's really aggravating. Okay, so notifications. All right, let me see what I can do. Let's uh.
going to be choppy for a second. Let me go back to this. Sorry. Sorry about that. It's going to be choppy. For some reason, it's choppy when I do the, uh, the camera over here. All right. Uh, Fort and Wild Mavs. Tim Tim Grizz. Peter S. Thunder. J.H.D. Bulls. Kokon Heat. 616 Bucks. Ty Wizards. Tim Tim Hornets. Scott Bids Raptors. Brian Golf Clippers. Pin Items Nuggets. Uh, Sandbag Nets. Sorry. Twan Pistons. Ty Pelicans. J.P.M. Warriors. Quentin Timberwolves. Brian Sons. Twan Blazers. Brian Golf Magic. Fortin with the Rockets, Kokon Celtics, Quentin Lakers, Josh D. Cavs, 616 Sixers, appropriate, Fortin Kings, Kokon Knicks, Fortin Hawks, Peter S. Jazz, Ramon Spurs, and Don with the Pacers. So, I know that's choppy. Um, let me I don't know. Let's see if this uh, corrects any. And then if not, I may restart it and then we'll get going. But we can't sit here forever. I'm not going to keep you guys all night. Um, which is unfortunate that it's it's doing this. Let me see if this is choppy. Um, any better? Let's see. This one is the mic, which has been choppy every time I've tried it with this, but we'll see. Um, hopefully not. Let's see. OBS is uh, pretty aggravating. I don't know what, what happened with the settings, but... It's a stupid mic. I think I'm gonna buy another mic. Sounds good now. Oh wow. Okay, we'll get going. It worked. Sounds good. If it messes up or changes, uh, let me uh, let me know, and I'll you know obviously stop and correct it. Just put something in the chat. I'll try to keep up with it. All right, we're gonna do the. Uh, we'll go. Um, Blaster, we'll do the blasters, the megas, and then we'll do the uh, uh, hobby last. Can I have me and Gene watch over us tonight? All 
Let's see. All right. Let's get going. 15 minutes. Oh, the charities. I'm sorry. I got to go over that. Sorry about that, guys. I almost forgot. So the charity that I chose, that I had chosen, was Janie's Fund. Or, um, yeah, I'm sorry. Janie's Fund. It's uh, Stephen Tyler from Aerosmith. It's his charity, and it's for, like, abused young girls. Um, physical and sexual. It's like a, they, they basically puts houses up. He builds these houses and it's like an escape where they can go and get away if they're in a bad situation. Um, it's a really good charity. I did a little research and uh, somebody uh, asked me to, to use that one for uh, one of the breaks, which I did. Happy birthday, Larva. Um, so uh, I did that one and I had already chosen that and donated to it and then Somebody messaged me and asked if I uh, had one for tonight, and I. Um, they asked if I would do the uh, National Down Syndrome Society, NDSS.org, because today is like a World Down Syndrome Day for like awareness. So um, it's actually today, March thirty or March twenty first. So I figured one out will do too. So I donated to that one, and I put that one in the description. So double donations tonight. It's uh, uh, World Down Syndrome and Janie's Fund. So the links are in there if you want to throw something at them. A couple dollars. There's no minimum. Um, so you can donate like a dollar or two to one of them if you want. No, obviously, you don't have to to participate in the breaks, and you don't shouldn't feel obligated. It's just something that I like doing, um, and I give those out of my own pocket. So... Um, yeah, no, I like, uh, I don't know, it's a way to bring awareness to certain charities. So if you've never bought in, if you're on eBay and you're new, um, it's up tight. Uh, I don't, I'll pull this up in a second. I'll pull, bring it back up before I get started because there's some new people joining. But um, I was just going over the charities. For any of you that don't know, I don't advertise this on the listing. Um, so if you see this from eBay, I don't put it on the listing and advertise that it goes to charity. But on each one of the breaks... And I do whatever the cost of that break is. So this one, I think, was like 25 bucks on the site and like 28 on eBay. Um, whatever the cost of the break is, before the break, I'll pick a charity and I'll donate a spot, equivalent of a spot, out of my pocket to one of the charities. And then I'll link it. So if you're new, which there was a lot of new people in this one from eBay, um, that's something we do. So, you know, it's a way to, you know, bring a little bit of awareness to a charity. So... You can find the donation links below if you want to throw something at them, but it's not advertised. Um, I feel like it could be misconstrued if I advertise it like I'm trying to sell break spots, you know, for a charity. So I don't put it in the ad. It's just something that I do on the video. So anyway, we'll get started and I'll show uh, Ty, you got... Uh, you got some good news, Ty. You got the Pelicans in this one, one of your spots. So, congrats on that. Uh, hopefully, we can pull some Zions for you. Um, Ty buys into some of these. He's a regular. So, appreciate him supporting this and helping, uh, you know, allowing us to do these. This is like a little side thing that I started, and it's a lot of fun. And we've uh, raised a couple hundred dollars already for some charities. So, not too bad. And that's that I know of. I mean, some people may donate and not tell me. So, all right, box number one. Um, we have a blaster first. So, gonna get one of these out of the way. I did a video earlier. I haven't uploaded it. I was doing a test for the sound, and I did two blasters and uh, a prism from last year. So $100 versus $100 was kind of the theme. $100 worth of these, $100 worth of prism from last year to see which one was better. Um, so if you want to learn how to turn $200 into about 20, watch that video when I upload it. Could not. Uh, it's pretty bad. It's pretty bad pack. So hopefully I got the bad luck out of the way on my personal stuff and you guys get to reap the rewards. All right, pack one, Dwight Powell. Terry Rozier, we got a Kawhi, T minus, three, two, one, and a nice Kobe White base. So, not bad in the first one. Yeah, I didn't have any luck in my packs. 
them in my boxes. Marcus Smart, Paul George. Got a Damian Lillard, My House, and Justin Holiday. It's a little crooked. Hold on. Let's see if I can straighten that up a bit. There we go. I have a new mat coming. I don't like this mat. I've got a new one. It's got a logo on it, so kind of excited about that. Harrison Barnes, Rajon Rondo. We got a Giannis Fantasy Stars and a Darius Garland base. Those are cool. I like the Fantasy Stars. It's like a, a Galaxy. Anybody that collects sneakers or gets into sneakers, it's like the uh, Galaxy foam posits. That's what it reminds me of. All right, uh, Russell Westbrook. We got a Luca, and we got our first Hollow, and it is a My House of Zion. Nice hit right there. Got the Hollow My House Zion. That is Ty with the Pelicans. Nice hit, Ty. Set him down and get him sleeved up. We'll pull some sleeves out just in case. Let's get him sleeved. And put him up there for now. So we got one on the board already. A hollow Zion. My house. Not the base. I mean, not the rookie, but still. It's a nice one. We pulled a purple one last night in the break. That same card. All right, we got a Julius Randle and a Kawhi Leonard. And we got the purple Kobe White, my house. And Tremont Waters behind it. So, uh, not doing too bad on the uh, my house inserts. All right. We got another hollow in this one. Got a Marvin Bagley, Mo Bamba. We got a rookie, Jordan Clarkson. Can it be? It is Quindary Weatherspoon. Nice though. Rookie color. You'll take it. This is out of a blaster too. Not a bad blaster. All right, we got Lonzo, Wesley Matthews. We got a purple. Our rookie is Quindary Weatherspoon. And Damari Carroll. I almost said Damar DeRozan. I really should sleeve some of these up as I go because when it's over, it takes so long to sleeve all of these, but I don't want to waste you guys' time. All right, blaster number two. Um, All right, now let's pull some, uh, some color rookies. Right, what did we get in that one? One, we got one hollow in that box, rookie. Of the rated rookie, not the inserts. All right, blaster number two, box number two. We have, upside down, Oh, that's why. It's a uh, auto. All right, we got a Kawhi Leonard and Justin Robinson. The Kawhi is the splashdown. And our auto is GCK. Um, man, who is GCK? He's on the Rockets. Gary Clark. No wonder I didn't know him. And they literally make autos of everybody in this set. All right, Rockets. Uh, you got a silver auto of uh, Mr. Clark right here. No wonder I didn't know GCK. Okay. Well, we got an auto at least. You don't have to get one in that, so it's better than a 
base, maybe. I don't know. Maybe whoever has the Rockets, would you rather have a Gary Clark or a base Harden? You tell me. Clint Capella, Jamal Murray, and we got a Kareem Winter Stays and Fultz. All right. Malik Monk, Chris Middleton. They're doing the upside down stuff. Ben Simmons Express Lane and a rated rookie of Luca Error. The error card. Kendrick Nunn is the better error card to get, but still a cool card. Could be uh, something to collect. All right. Uh, we got D'Angelo Russell and Al Horford. And we got a Kyrie Hollow of the Splashdown. And Jonas for the Grizz. It's a cool card. The Hollows look so good. I want to see a Zion. I pulled two silvers out of the Prism set, but I've yet to pull a hollow Zion out of Optic or Jaw. Then breaks or for myself. JJ Redick, Goran Dragic. We got a Devin Booker purple express lane and Brandon Clark rookie. It's a nice one. All right, we have a Lou Williams and James Harden, and they're upside down. It is a Jeff Teague hollow and Jay Crowder Rockets. Which card would you rather have? Gary Clark, Silverado, James Harden base. I'd rather have the auto. Never know. Gary Clark could uh, turn into something. All right. This pack is stubborn. Last pack of the blasters, and then we'll go into the megas. All right. We have Mitchell Robinson, Tim Hardaway, Tobias Harris, Purple, and Cody Martin, Rookie. So, not too bad. Um, so, we got an auto out of a blaster, which is not guaranteed in this one. So, let's set these over here and give us a little more space. All right. So, this is mega number one mega box number one o two seven o nine these are Walmart megas so it's the pink we'll do the pink last all right, pack one. You get eight packs, and then you get two five-card packs of the pink. Lou Williams, James Harden, uh, Kareem Winter Stays, and a Cam Reddish. The Hawks, nice. You got a Tim Hardaway. Uh, a silver Paul George or hollow T minus three, two, one. Say it every time, but it's say prism. If you don't know on these, it's kind of hard to tell. And then a Ben Simmons express lane and Reggie Jackson base. Those of you that were in the break last night, uh, I have one of them done packed up labeled ready to ship and the other one is uh, almost done so they should all go out Monday morning so you should get them Wednesday maybe if you're close maybe Tuesday 
Mitchell Robinson, Montrez Harrell. We got an Embiid Hollow Fantasy Stars and Yondu. It's a cool card, Fantasy Stars. I like those. There's a lot of inserts in this set. Jedi. How are you, buddy? Hope everyone's doing well, staying inside, not going crazy. Bogdan, Ben Simmons, got a Jarrett Culver, my house, and Jeff Teague. Zion over there, the hollow, my house. That was a nice one. That was in the first blaster. All right, we got Drew Holiday and Danny Green. Big Cat bowling and Admiral Schofield base. Looks like he's bowling in that one. All right, we got a Bazemore and we got another hollow, my house of RJ. And then a Kyrie Express Lane and an Ish Smith. And we're crushing the my house. So last night we had the uh, gold Nikolai Jokic, two of 10, purple Zion. Tonight we've pulled the hollow Barrett and the Zion. So I know that my house, the inserts are not the best cards you can pull, but it is a hollow and it looks cool. I would be happy if that was my box, if I got that in there, so. Eric Bledsoe, Fred Van Fleet. We got a Timmy Duncan winner stays and Kevin Porter, rookie. And last regular pack of this mega. Got some color. Buddy Hield, Aaron Gordon. Back card is Blake Griffin and it is Jalen Brown. It's a nice player. Nice hit for the Celtics. All right, the pinks. Let's see what we get. These are uh, kind of random. I've had some that give me two rookies and some give you one. It's usually the fourth card. We've got a Jabari Parker for the Hawks. John Wall for the Wizards. De'Aaron Fox. Our rookie is P.J. Washington. That's nice. And Isaiah Thomas. So we got a P.J. Pink. It's a nice hit on that one. And then our other pack of the pink. Let's see what we get. Evan Fournier. Jalen Brown, another one. Uh, Damari Carroll. Our rookie is Goga and C.D. Osman. I have uh, a lot of his cards. If there's a Cavs fan and you are interested, shoot me a message. I pulled an auto. I think I've got like his whole rainbow of this. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, let's see. Let's get this ready to... Move on to the next one. Um, one second. Organize this a bit. I don't want to knock it over. Man, I've got cards all over the place over here. I'm going to have to take some time tonight and go through these. There's a CD Osman from earlier. I need to uh, list that or move it. Trade it, something. I don't collect him. I know it's not worth the time. It's a couple bucks maybe, but if there's a fan out there, if you collect the calves. All right, second mega box. 02709, so it's out of the same case. All right, pink's over there. And 
Here we go. First pack. Eric Gordon. Nikolai. Nicola. Uh, Steph Curry. T minus base. And Justin Holiday. Boom. Donovan Mitchell. We got a Braun 321 hollow insert. And then a DeMar DeRozan My House. And a Darius Garland rookie. It's a good pack. That's a hollow T minus for LeBron. Nice hit for the Lakers. We're killing the inserts, but we're not hitting uh, the rookie color like we would want. Uh, McCollum and Otto Porter. D'Angelo Russell and Miles Turner. All right, we got a Kelly Olenek and a Gerald Green. James Harden and our rookie is Waters for Boston. And straighten them up a little bit. Okay. All right, we got a Dwight Powell, Terry Rozier. Got a purple Paul Pierce, uh, Winter Stays, and Jordan Clarkson. It's a nice looking card. If you're a Celtics fan, Marcus Smart. Another My House Hollow of Joel Embiid. Larry Bird, Winter Stays, and Weatherspoon, another rookie of his. That's pretty crazy, the uh, My House inserts. My lord. I wonder if we pull a green one before it's over with. I haven't pulled a Zach Levine either. I almost always hit his card. Harrison Barnes and Paul George. Uh, Steph Curry, Express Lane. Jeremy Lamb, a base. Last regular pack of the uh, Megas. And then we got the Pinks. Rajon Rondo. Russell Westbrook. Montrez Harrell Hollow. And Ty Jerome for Phoenix. All right. And then we got the Pinks. And then we'll get to the big box the hobby. All right. We have Joe Ingles and Enos Cantor. Keldon Johnson, rookie. There's some rookie color we got two in this one. Horton Tucker and Shabazz Napier. So we got two rookie colors in that one. It's pretty random. Sometimes you get two, sometimes you get one in these. I think you get one in every one of them, though. I don't know that I've opened one without one. Uh, Zubik. Steph Curry, pink. Uh, Gary Harris. We got an SGA, and our rookie is Terrence Mann. And wow, look at these. Look at the miscut. Let me show this. I don't know if you're going to be able to see this. Look at his arm. Like his hand is there, his face outlines there. The box is like right there, the other one is right up there. Rated rookies down, the ball, the hand, and then SGA. Look at that. Look at that cut. Look, you, you can see the next card up there in the pink. Wow. You see the outline of him right there? Look at the ball. That's... Hmm. Imagine you get the... Uh, you get like a Zion or a Jaw, and it's you got like seven of the bodies on there, like that. All right, so let's uh, straighten these up a little bit. I'm gonna set these over to the side and get them out of the way, give us some space because this hobby takes up a lot of space. And then we'll put the base over here as well. Okay, so 
Hobby box. Good luck, everybody. Hopefully, we hit something good. We're due for another gold vinyl one of one. It's been two boxes since we pulled one, so it's time for another. We're going to put these over here and get them out of the way, actually, over here. Put the box over there. All right. Pack one of hobby. We got Kelly Olenek. Gerald Green, got a Malik Monk Hollow, and Devin Booker. Pack two. You know, you can get gold in these. Almost. I almost did it again. Dwight Powell, Terry Rozier, Nasir Little for the Blazers, and come on, man. Come on, brah. Rudy Gobert, 126 out of 199. Almost. Almost got the gold. Kind of looks like gold right there. Yeah, worst cuts ever. Sorry, buddy. That's uh, Panini, man. You want to try to send that in you can sometimes get a replacement this is our hit in this so i'm going to set that one down there we got paul george all-stars and andrew wiggins and marcus smart and our hit is w c s is that willie collie stein it is going to be Willie Colley Stein, 15 out of 49 for the Warriors. Dominator signature sticker. Uh, not the rookie, but not terrible. Could have been worse. I don't know. You don't believe that, but it actually could because our auto in the blaster was worse. Gary Clark. Kali Stein, Warriors, Dominator, numbered to 49, blue. Kawhi Leonard, Marvin Bagley, we got some more color. Jeff Teague, and it is Tristan Thompson, Pink Velocity, which is numbered to 79, that is 4 of 79. Uh, nice hit if you're a Kardashian fan. Paul Millsap. Got a hollow. Cody Zeller. And we got Kyrie Hollow for Brooklyn. And DeAndre Jordan for Brooklyn. Not bad. Not a terrible... Uh, like there's a mark on there not a terrible uh, hollow if you're gonna get a base bet this is an all-star former all right we got another hollow we got DJ Augustine Kevin Knox Steven Adams this time with Jordan Clarkson mean muggin he looks pissed Look at that. He's ready to sling an elbow. All right. Got a Justice Winslow for the Heat. Eric Gordon, all clear for takeoff for Wiggy. And a rookie of Quindary Weatherspoon.
Um, that is just the standard. That is not the green. It's just the color of it. Uh, lime green is like one number to 149. Okay, got Trey Young, baller, and LeBron. Uh, LeBron base. Oh, there we go. All clear for takeoff Zion and Alexander Walker base. Got another Zion insert. That's a hobby exclusive. It's a, the base base insert though, not a parallel. All right, we got a Mo Bamba and Alonzo Ball. Stargazing of Westbrook with a line down the middle. It's probably not going to show up. It's right there. You can kind of see it. An Admiral Schofield rookie. <laughs> he said, yeah, yeah, I got a hit. Paul George, Harrison Barnes, Malcolm Brogdon Rainmakers. I can't believe that guy got an insert. We got a Cam Reddish rookie. That guy got an insert this year. That's when you know they're making a ton of inserts in a set. I'm not a fan of, of the inserts like that. Um, I wish they would do less. And just, I mean, you don't have to guarantee a hit in each pack. Just like old school. Laurie Markinen and Bam. And we got a red. Let's see. Got DeMar DeRozan on the back and Donovan Mitchell. That is numbered to 99. 86 of 99. 86. Man, we're killing the Corona virus parallels. I think we got like a number to 79 of the other dude, Rudy. Uh, let's see. Wesley Matthews and Siakam. And we got a hollow of Jamal Murray and an Ish Smith base. We are not getting the uh, best rookie color in this hobby, but we still got a few packs. We're about halfway done. All right, we got a lime green back there. It's another Donovan Mitchell, and it is Jeremy Lamb, Kent Bazemore for Portland. It's going to be numbered to 149, 47 out of 149 for Bays. All right. Oh, no, we're way further than half. No, we got uh, seven left, counting this one. Rajon Rondo and Russell Westbrook. And we got some rookie color right there, finally. Reggie Jackson on the back. And Tyler Harrow, hollow. Nice card for the uh, Heat. It's a nice hit. He's one of the better rookies. It's a good hit for the uh, whoever got Miami. RJ, you're getting bounced. Uh, you're an insert. If it was your rookie, maybe. Arrow's going up there. All right, that's a nice one. We finally got some color on the rookies. Tyler Harrow. Mean Gene approves. Clint Capella, Jamal Murray. We got a JJ Redick Rainmakers and Carson Edwards base. All right, five more. Let's get some uh, some mojo right here. John Wall and Jabari Parker and a Damian Lillard Elite Dominators and Kevin Porter. That is a hollow insert for Dame. It's a cool card. All right. Bottom of the box. Let's see what we get. C 
CJ McCollum. Auto Porter. The rookie is Ty Jerome. And we got a hollow of Embiid stargazing. It's the second hollow insert we pulled of him. All right. Three more. I still have not seen my boy, Zach Levine. I think the streak might be over. Luca, Julius Randle. We got a Jason Tatum Elite Dominators and a rookie of Yandu. Jason Tatum. All right, two more. Let's get some... Uh, and good luck on this one. Darren Fox, Evan Fournier, and we got the Elite Dominators of Embiid and Blake Griffin. Last pack. Mean Gene's going to rub it for good luck. Let's see what we get. Jalen Brown up top, Serge Ibaka, Blake Griffin All-Stars, and last card rookie is Isaiah Roby for Dallas. Mean Gene, you're fired. He's getting replaced by somebody else next time. So, uh, we'll go over these, we'll go over the hits or the parallels and colors. Rudy Gobert, that is uh, Gobert, 199. Malik Monk, Blake Griffin, All-Stars, Elite Dominators of Tatum and Embiid. Uh, Embiid Stargazing Hollow. Dame Elite Dominators Hollow. JJ Redick, RJ My House Hollow. Bazemore, uh, Lime Green to 149. Jamal Murray. Donovan Mitchell, Red, uh, Malcolm Brogdon, Rainmakers, uh, Stargazing, Russ, Zion, all clear for takeoff. We didn't pull a base Zion or a jaw in this. Man, I swear, they are really, really hard to pull. Wiggins, all clear. Adams and Irving, hollow. Tristan Thompson, pink. That is not the uh, mega pink. That's the... Uh, like Velocity, number to 79, Tristan, and Paul George, All-Stars. So I'll sleeve those up. The rookies, Roby, Fiondu, Ty Jerome, Kevin Porter, Carson Edwards, Cam Reddish, Schofield, Alexander Walker, Weatherspoon, and Nasir Little. And the auto was uh, Collie Stein, blue, number to 49. 15 out of 49 and then there's the base so um, we did pull a second auto um, Gary Clark that was a just a random freebie in the um, blaster the pinks Alexander um, we did get a Steph Curry in there Joe Ingles and Enos uh, Montrez Harrell hollow Steph Curry Express Lane, Embiid My House, Hollow, Winter Stays, Pierce and Larry Legend, Splash of uh, Harden, D'Angelo Russell Express Lane, got a Hollow uh, LeBron, T minus, DeRozan, Curry, Osman, Carroll, Fournier, Brown, Thomas, Fox, Wall, and Parker were the pinks in that one, the non rookie pinks. Jalen Brown Hollow, Duncan and Irving, Big Cat, Culver, Embiid Hollow Fantasy Stars, Paul George Hollow 321, Ben Simmons, Tobias Harris, Jeff Teague, Booker, Hollow Splashdown. That's like 10 or 12 Hollow inserts we pulled. Uh, ben Simmons and Kareem, another Splashdown, Damari Carroll. Blue Kobe White, my house. That was a nice one. And Giannis, Dame, and Kawhi. And then the rookies in the other boxes. The pinks. 
Horton Tucker, Terrence Mann, Keldon Johnson. Ty Jerome, Weatherspoon, Tremont, Garland were the base. Goga, P.J. Washington, Pinks. Porter, Schofield, Viondu, Reddish, Martin, Brandon Clark. Lucas Samanich, Justin Robinson, Weatherspoon, Weatherspoon Hollow, Waters, Garland, and the base, Kobe White. So, um, all of these will be top-loaded and sleeved, the ones that I go over. These, and the base will just be penny-sleeved. So, um... I'll get those packaged up and ready to ship. And then, of course, in the back, we have the hollow My House Zion and Tyler Harrow Hollow. So, rookie. So, pretty good cards right there, those two. Um, appreciate everyone that watched. Um, I'm going to do the giveaway, the $20 giveaway. So, give me one second. Let me pull that up. Let me get the uh, people that participated. All right, so we've got uh, the list of people. I'm gonna do it three times. That's everybody that bought in. Three times, whoever's on top, I will send you a $20 discount code for our website which is awesomebreaks.com if you're from ebay um ebay the, the, the breaks are all it's the same breaks they're always cheaper on the website because of the 10 percent. i have to pay 10 percent fee to ebay so um that sucks so i do them a little bit cheaper on uh the website so i'll give the code on the website because it's better value um yeah and i'll just do it's 20 dollars off anything so um i have some supplies that i'll put up on there you don't have to use it on a break if you don't want to um the supplies that i had on there are back ordered from bcw uh they sent me an email the other day tons of stuff is back ordered because of the virus the supply chain in china's got everything jacked up so i know uh like top loaders they're bcw the whole company's out of top loaders to june but some of the boxes and stuff like that I have on there, they're back ordered, so I had to move them to sold out. But um, if you're ever looking for supplies, if you need penny sleeves or one touch or whatever, look on the site. If it's not on there, shoot me a message and I can hook you up on that. I get those super, super, super cheap. Um, like super cheap. Like uh, there's a ton of markup in that stuff, just so everybody knows. Uh, you should really never pay more than a dollar for a pack of penny sleeves. Um, maybe if you're buying one, but if you're buying bulk, it's super marked up from most people. So if you're looking for something like that, shoot me a message and I can I can hook you up on that. I don't even care about making money on that. So I can give you uh, some pretty good prices on it. All right, so the $20, person on top after three. Here we go. One two and three twan so twan you got a twenty dollar credit it's a discount i can't give a gift card because uh the store that i pay for is um like a basic store on shopify and it's like 30 or 40 bucks a month or something when i pay for that um, if you want to do gift cards, you have to bump the store up and it's, uh, like a hundred dollars a month and you can get, you know, more listings and stuff like that. But I don't need the listings cause obviously we're just doing breaks, but you can do gift cards. So I have to do it in a discount. So I'll make a code for you and I'll send it to you. And it's basically $20 off at checkout. So if you just want to do a break, that's $20. You can add that and it's just going to charge you the like, $3 shipping to get in a, a spot in the break. Or if you want to buy a bigger one, you can, um, you know, add it and it'll knock $20 off. If you've bought into a break and, uh, it's not filling or it's slow to fill. If you want, um, to move to another break, just shoot me a message and I can, 
you know, switch it or credit you and move it over. Or if you just want a refund, you don't want to wait. I understand that as well. Just shoot me a message. Uh, I just ask that you, uh, if you're going to ask for a refund, you do it before it fills. Just so, because when it fills, I have to send out like the time and date and it's, you know, it's kind of wrong to do that to everyone else that's in there to have to change it and cut it and move it. So once it sells out, it's pretty final, but obviously I'm not going to hold somebody and lock them in if it's taking a while to fill. So if you want to move it, let me know if you want your money back, you know, I'm perfectly fine with that. So Tuan, I'll send you that email and uh, I'll get the rest of these packed up and um, shipped out Monday. So if you bought into the hobby break from last night, that one's done. Your tracking should be uploaded. Um, they're packed up, ready to ship. If you uh, were in the 10 blaster break, that one's almost done. I've got everything like sleeved and um, organized. I just have to break it down and put teams uh, together for the buyers and print the label. So it takes a little bit to do this because I sleeve every card. So even like the base vets get penny sleeved and all those are top loaded. So it takes a little bit to go through them. So, but I'll have, uh, I'll have it done by, by Monday. So they'll go up Monday. So you should get them. Uh, if you're close to the South, you might can get them Tuesday, but probably Wednesday. And if you're West coast, it may take three days. So it'd be Thursday. So, um, check out the other breaks. If you're into it, um, if you had fun, I try to do breaks random and i try to keep the cost down just so people can get in there and you know take part the random team is can be frustrating sometimes you know like uh you know for example boston you know they've got a bunch of rookies but they're not super desirable everybody wants the pelicans but just selling the teams for each break uh it just gets up there for the pelicans and you know, I mean, unless you're going to spend a couple hundred dollars, you're not going to get a chance at a Zion. So if you have an idea for a break or a product you want me to do, shoot me a message. I'll be happy to put one together and build a breakout if there's interest in it. Um, there's some product coming out. There's some mosaic coming out. And I thought about trying to get some product for that for a break. Um, I don't know. I don't know if you guys are into that. I may do like a mix maybe do like five blasters of optic or and then five of mosaic it's just the price of optic and prism is just going up so quickly that it just drives the cost up so much when you're doing the retail so um and i haven't been able to get any like for actual retail price so the price is basically based on resale if i could find some for 20 like in the walmarts you know i could actually do a pretty low cost like optic break you know a couple of retail products for like 12 15 bucks but i haven't been able to find any um so if there's a product you're interested in shoot me a message hope everyone had fun i am going to start sleeving these up because it gets overwhelming when you wait and you're looking at all the uh, base vets so start doing that and uh hopefully i've got some videos coming out um I've got a pretty unique product that I ordered from like Chase My Comics. So I don't know if you guys have heard of him. The dude, uh, he puts together comics. Um, thanks for hosting. Yep. Um, yeah, y'all have fun, man. Have a good night. The uh, Chase My Comics, he, uh, he did a thing where it's like repacks and you buy the cards and it's comics. But he did one the other day for basketball. It was pretty interesting, and then he did a football one, so I'm going to review his product. I've got one. It should be here Monday. I'm going to do a video when I open it and see what uh, what that's about, see what we can come up with on that, see if it's worth buying. But I like the, the idea of it, and he seems like a nice guy, so I wanted to buy one and support him. I think it was like 60 or 70 bucks, but it's pretty crazy cards you get. So I'm going to review that, so I'll have that coming up. I don't have any more boxes left to open for videos. I've opened up all the personal stuff. So if I do any, I'll have to buy them, and uh, it's really expensive right now, so I don't know how many of those I can get, but we'll see. Um, yeah, so just be on the lookout. If you go to the eBay store and you're going to check out, use uh, AWESOME as the code if you don't have a discount code. It's 10% off, and click on the link 
in the description if you're from eBay and you want to stick with eBay, if you're more comfortable with it, I don't mind. Um, if you click through the link to the store um, in the description, that link automatically will give you 10% off our store. So save 10%. I mean, not everybody does it, and, you know, it's kind of wasting money for you, so you get 10% off. Um, so check that out. It's in the description, all that, and the social media, and all that stuff's down below. So uh, one last thing, too, on eBay. I have some UPIC listings up, um, like singles, like of rookies from Prism and Optic and base cards and I try to do like a dollar or like 99 cents for some of them with free shipping and then when you ship for free it's plain white envelope so you basically put a stamp on it you put it in a top loader put it in an envelope and then put a stamp on it you just ship it that way but there's no tracking um, there's no tracking for it because it's a stamp so you just mark it as shipped on eBay and what's happened is um, it's kind of like an honor system for card collectors that you just do it. And what's happened is um, people are starting to take advantage of it because there's a lot of new collectors coming to the hobby because of Optic. Then they're kind of scamming. And I've been scammed like probably a dozen times this month on that, which uh, it's not the end of the world because it's dollar cards. You know, I don't mind. Like if somebody paid a dollar for like that Russell Westbrook, you buy the stamp for 50 cents, the envelope, the top loader, you make like a quarter. So it's, you know, you're not making tons of money on it, but it's just moving single cards. And the main reason I do it is for eBay, for the transactions. So um, the more transactions, the better your store, their algorithm, and then feedback and stuff like that. What's happening, though, is they're buying them and they're not, uh, they're claiming that they don't get them. And then they file a refund and you either have to refund them or, um, you know, you, they'll, they'll leave a negative feedback. Sometimes they still do that. You know, I'll refund it and they still leave a negative. So uh, I don't know that I'm going to be able to continue doing that, which is pretty unfortunate. I'm going to have to probably take those listings down just because, I mean, I've had multiple people where I've sent them the card. They say they don't get it. I send them another card and refund them. So basically give them a free card. I'm basically paying them a dollar to, you know, for their problem, air quotes. And they still will uh, leave negative feedbacks to it. So. A little unfortunate, but if there's a workaround for that, if anyone has it, shoot me a message because I would appreciate it. Um, obviously, you can't sell these with $3 shipping, a single card. No one's going to pay you a dollar plus three. No one's going to pay $4 for that card. So um, I might do something where it's like buy four, get four free. So you have to buy like eight cards for eight bucks, and then I do the tracking, but... I don't know. It's kind of at a crossroads on that. I may have to take that listing down so I can't sell my singles anymore. So I may put them up on the uh, Shopify that way and just do like groups like you pick and you just pick five or six rookies and they're a dollar each and then I'll ship them. But anyway, I'll let you guys get it's uh, 11. We've got some breaks up on eBay and the store. So check them out when they fill up or get close. I'll set the date. I usually give about two days notice. I'll set the date and send you a message and look for your cards next week. And if you're from eBay, once you get them, I would appreciate it if you'd leave a feedback and um, help me out a little bit, especially help offset some of those scammers that are, you know, leaving a negative feedback over a dollar, a 99 cent card with free shipping. So I would appreciate it. And don't forget the charities. So hope everyone has a good weekend. Stay inside, stay safe. Hopefully all this stuff passes. We can get back to watching basketball and uh, collecting cards and get back out and socialize. So you guys have a good weekend, and I'll see you in the next one. Thanks for uh, stopping by.